Someone asked, do giant pandas attack humans? The answer is yes, they absolutely can. In our perception, giant pandas generally eat bamboo and look adorably cute on the outside. However, their ancestors were actually carnivorous due to climate changes. Prey became increasingly scarce and many large animals went extinct, disrupting their food chain. The nutrition obtained from small animals wasn't enough to compensate for the energy they expended hunting. Only when they were desperately hungry did they start experimenting with eating bamboo. Why do giant pandas love climbing trees? Giant pandas' ancestors share the same evolutionary tree as bears. Climbing trees allows them to observe their surroundings and better avoid natural predators. We often see in zoos that giant pandas are either eating or on their way to eat something. Are they really that hungry? The reason they eat all day is because bamboo itself has very little nutritional value. They can consume up to 66 pounds of bamboo daily, but their digestion and absorption rates are extremely low. They must constantly eat to supplement their nutrition. Since they eat so much, they also defecate. Frequently, can giant panda poop be used to make tea? The answer is yes. This tea not only doesn't smell bad, but it actually has a subtle, fragrant aroma. Bamboo contains volatile, aromatic compounds, and these substances create a fresh bamboo fragrance in their droppings. The taste is quite unique, but if you ask me to drink it personally, let's just pretend I never mentioned this could a wild giant panda defeat a tiger in a fight. Although giant pandas have strong bite force, they basically have no chance of winning against a tiger. Tigers are superior to giant pandas in terms of body, size, strength, speed and attack power.